Hello, in this session, we are going to look at how you can pass the values to your variables from the command line. So in the last session, we looked at how you can uh, call the variables or how you can refer the variables within your configuration files. And we also looked at how you can make use of the default to pass the value to your variable. So for example, here, if you look at this file, I'm making use of this default to pass the value. Now, default can be used as your last resort if you don't want to pass any or if you're not passing any values that is when your default can be used now let's say i don't have this default so let's say i'm going to comment this out all right and now if i run my terraform plan you will see that my terraform will expect a value for the variables that i've declared so here if you see it is expecting me to pass the value for this likewise once i pass this value so let's say I'll pass this value, then it will expect the instance type. So let's say t2.micro and then the region. So this is other way that you can pass the values to your variables. So if you have like lots of variables, uh, your Terraform will prompt you to pass the values and you can provide the values and Terraform will pick, take those values and provide it to your configuration files. Now, the other way that you can provide the values to your variables is from the command line itself that is when you're running the terraform command you can use you can make use of certain flags to pass the values so to specify individual variables on the command line itself we can make use of this hyphen var option whenever we are running the terraform plan command or when we are running the terraform apply command so here when i'm using this terraform plan command i can make use of this hyphen var flag to pass the values to the variables that I have declared. Okay, so here, for example, this is how you can make use of it. So I can say Terraform plan hyphen var equals to in quotes, double quotes, your variable name, the label name, and the value that you want to use. You can also pass multiple variables within a single line command if you want, like if you have declared multiple variables, then we can make use of this hyphen var flag multiple times to pass the Value. So let me show you an example for this over here. So the variables that I have declared, right? So here are the variables I have. So let's run this Terraform plan hyphen var equals to within quotes. So we'll use this easy to region equals to the value. So let's say this will be US. So let's say just for the sake of example, I'll give US West one. Then again hyphen var equals to within double quotes the instance type and equals to let's say we'll go with the two dot medium then again hyphen var equals to the third variable equals to the value so this is how you can pass the values to your variables from the command line when you're running the terraform plan command or when you are running the terraform apply command and when when i run this terraform will take these values provided to the configuration so you can see here so if you look at the instance type you will see it is using the t2 dot medium that i have passed on the command line likewise you can see the ami that i have passed so this is another way for you to pass the values to your variables when you are uh, running the terraform plan command or the terraform apply command so i can make use of this when i'm using the terraform apply command as well so here i can say terraform apply and i can pass this to uh, provide the values to my terraform configuration file so you can see this also works so this is how you can make use of the command line to pass the values to your variables um, uh, using this hyphen var flag so you can Depending on the variables that you have declared, you can pass uh, a single variable, multiple variables by using this hyphen var flag. That's all for this session. Thank you. Once again, before you leave, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And if you like the video, leave a like and please share the video.